The equation for the reaction of ICl and H2 is shown below. The rate constant K for this reaction is 1.63 times 10 to the negative 6 decimeters cubed per mole per second. What is the overall order of the reaction? A, 0, B, 1, C, 2, or D, 3. If we start by writing a general rate equation, that's going to be rate is equal to K, which is the rate constant, multiplied by the concentration of one of our reactants and the concentration of another reactant. And then depending on the rate, so let's say we had a first order and a zeroth order, that's going to mean the overall order of reaction is first order, because one plus zero is one. And so then we can kind of work out the units. So the way we do this is we do rate divided by A and then the concentration of B. But we wouldn't include the concentration of B if it was zeroth order. And that's going to equal K. And we can work out the units of K to work out what our overall order of reaction is. So rate is measured in moles per decimeter cubed per second. And then concentration is moles per decimeter cubed. So if this overall reaction was first order, we could cancel out the moles per decimeter cubed and we would get a rate constant with the units of seconds to the minus one. In the question, we have decimeters cubed moles to the minus one, seconds to the minus one. So it's not first order. So we can cross out B. It's not going to be zeroth order because zeroth order would be having nothing on the bottom. And then we would get the same units as rate. So it's not zeroth order. If we move on to second order, that's going to be divided by moles per decimeter cubed moles per decimeter cubed because both of our reactants would be to the power of one or one of them would be second order and one of them would be zero. But we're going to multiply concentration units twice. For the sake of this example, let's say that both are first order. And so our overall reaction is going to be zeroth order. And then we cancel out one of our concentration units, but the other one we don't because we can't cancel it out. And that's going to result in decimeters cubed moles to the minus one and seconds to the minus one. That's because our decimeters cubed and moles are on the bottom. So we invert the indices. So the decimeters to the minus three becomes decimeters cubed. Moles becomes moles to the minus one. And then seconds will remain the same because it's on the top. It's not being divided by anything. And we can see that these units match our rate constant in, these, in this question. So our overall rate constant or our overall order of reaction is going to be second order, which is C. So to get the mark for this question, you need to write C in the answer box provided.